everyone, welcome back. I hope you all are doing great. Today I have a coach unboxing to share with you that I just received from UPS and I am excited to share this with you and see what fits inside. This is a new bag to coach for their spring summer 2022 line and the color is perfect for spring and summer. So I wanted to experiment with something. I do not own a bag in this color. And I thought, let's just try Coach. And I didn't see very many reviews or unboxings of this yet uh, because this is a new bag. So if you love Coach items, I do have a playlist from back when I started my channel of probably 30 to 50 Coach videos. And I go into detailed reviews. So I'll link that just in below in the description box. But without further ado, let's take a look at my new Coach bag. I did order this online. It took about three days to come from uh, Florida where their um, their distribution center is I just didn't feel like driving to the mall I know they have it in stock but let's just go ahead and check her out so here is the beautiful bow I opted for the gift wrapping you can get it regular or you can get it gift wrapped I always enjoy the packaging so here is the coach sticker and tissue paper it's been a while since I bought a coach bag. I don't know if you guys remember, maybe last summer. I think they tend to be like my summer inspiration for the styles. And hopefully I love this color. Here is the coach New York dust bag. To reveal, ta -da! this is the coach pillow Madison in the color light coral. Now this pack actually on the coach website, the color is not characterized what it is like true to life. This is a better view. Um, they call it light coral. However, this is what I would call a peach. Coral is a brighter, more orangey. This is a more peachy tone. So if you love peaches and nectarines, that's what this color is. So it's careful to realize to that the coach website is not the same, like the color does not show up correctly. On the coach Instagram, it does show up more true to color. I will link this exact bag and color in the description box and with the item number but I wanted to go over the details and see what fits with you guys. So this is the pillow Madison. Um, I have the quilted Madison in black. It's um, not as fluffy as this. I think this is kind of like a modern take on a Chanel 19 YSL puffer, just along those trendy lines. And when you're going with a trend, it's kind of nice to do a fun color. So as you can see, the coach tag here is fluffy going along with the theme. It has the coach turn lock here. There is branding underneath. As you can see, it says coach there. There is a back pocket, which I love the idea of a back pocket with a magnetic closure because it can secure your phone easy in and out. It has a double chain, just like my YSL Lulu and my Chanel flap. Now let's check out the inside. So what's different about this is, as you can see, the there are two flaps. There's a magnetic flap in the front that you can like slide something in, maybe thin. I'm gonna try my full-size Prada wallet and see if that fits. So my full-size Prada wallet does fit right there in the front. My phone would be in the back. And let's see how the chain works and how much fits inside. The thing with a puffer bag, especially one like made like this, is that there is not a lot of room. Do you see how once you open the flap, because of the puffiness, it doesn't fit a whole lot. So we're gonna see if a mini pochette can fit in here. I would probably stand that up to allow for more room. Um, let's see, my compact with powder, my hand cream, and that's a big hand cream, remember. Um, let's see, I don't need two hand creams. I have a pack of tissues, and then we said we'd put my cell phone, which is, this one is an iPhone 11. 
uh, but I know 13 and 12 also can fit. So my iPhone is in the back pocket and my full size Prada wallet is in the front pocket. That's my full size Prada wallet. I could put that one here if I wanted to, but do you see the mini pochette, the hand cream and the compact and the tissues? Because it's a pillow, it doesn't fit that much. It's not something that if you wanna carry a lot, even though I would consider this a small to medium sized bag, it carries a lot less than let's say the small Lulu. I have the medium, but I did have the small for many years. This carries significantly less than the small Lulu and less than the YSL puffer. So you're getting the aesthetic. And let me show you how it looks. So it got a little bit heavy, to be honest with you, once I loaded it up. This is a full leather bag. This is Napa leather, according to the Coach website. Napa leather is something that I've loved and used in Fendi. And this one seems a little bit more durable, Napa. You have the coach stamping here on the grommets. Here is the side. Here is the back. Here is the front. Here is the bottom. It is a thick puffer bag, but I'm gonna tell you, this is actually pretty heavy, and you saw I did not put too much in this bag. So let's see if I can crossbody it as a plus size fashion purse lady. It is a great crossbody. I am 5'1", but I'm very busty plus size. So keep in mind that if you are tall, this might not work for you as a crossbody, but this is where it hits on me considering I am plus size. But I love that it is like the Lulu with the double chain. The chain is made very well, as you can see. I would probably, like I did with my quilted Madison, I would wear it as a short shoulder and only wear it as a crossbody, like in a pinch. Like I did wear that one to a trip in New York City and it was great. So this is just a fun color. It's like peach, sherbet, super fun. I honestly do not have anything this color in my collection. So that's why I decided to give this a shot. I do love Napa leather. Um, Napa leather is pretty. Um, this one feels a little bit durable than Fendi Napa leather. So that's something to think about. But I do think this is a great piece. Uh, the retail price is $4.95 plus your state sales tax if you have it uh, with free shipping and free returns. So check this out. Uh, let me know Let me know down below if you have the Pillow Madison. Um, I know a few months back the Pillow Tabby was super popular and is super popular. That was kind of like a baguette style. That just wasn't... I liked it, but it just wasn't the right shape for my frame. So I was waiting for something like this to come out because this reminds me of the Lulu or the Puffer or even the Chanel 19 just because it's along that line of trend. The only thing that I would say that is a downside to me is once I put those items in it, it got rather heavy. If I had a scale, I, I could feel like this might be like a good two and a half pounds. And you saw I did not feel too much in it. So that's my only con would be once you load it up that it gets a little bit heavy because it's a full leather bag. It's not light like the YSL Puffer, um, but it is more structured. So if you do like the structure of a bag, then I would consider something like this. And they do have it in the classic black chalk, which is like a beautiful like cream white antique white color. This one is for spring, summer 2022, and I think they might even have a couple other colors. So I just wanted to share this with you guys, and I'm going to give her a once over and just kind of decide what I'm going to do on that, on the weight. I'm thinking I'm going to keep it, but I just got to walk around with it and kind of see how I can do with the weight if it's too much on my shoulder and I'll give you guys a full update. So if you have any questions, please leave them down below. Please give this video a thumbs up. I hope you guys are doing great and you're having a wonderful spring season. Talk to you soon. Bye.